Hello, this is Jean Marie, and welcome to my channel. I was going to do a quick face of the day and then show you a product review on some of the products that I've had. Um, well, I have had a couple of them, well, three of them for a while, and then this winter I just ended up getting the um, third one, I mean the fourth one for my birthday, not the third one. But um, anyway, let's get started. On my face, I'm wearing this Kat Von D palette. It's the uh, um, one I got for my birthday, and it comes in the metal packaging like this, and it is called Center. And this is one of my favorite palettes I think I've ever had, and I'll get started on why I love it so much. Okay. It has this metal container. I really love it. And then when you open it, you have all these beautiful shades. Starting with a pink, a light purple, a dark purple, a silvery black color, a silver, and then you have a dark silver, and then another one of those really shimmery uh, silvery, silvery black colors, and then a black, and then it comes with the eyeliner. I love that. That's one of my favorite palettes I think I ever owned, and I got this one around my birthday. And so that's what this looks like. It came from Sephora. Okay. And then the very first one I ever got comes in a container that looks like this. And it is called the Beethoven palette. And then you open it up and you have a black shade, a blue shade, a silver shade. Then you have a creamy white shade, a light purple shade, a dark purple shade, a brown shade. This is one of my favorite browns I've ever used. I use this in my crease a lot with a darker brown and I will blend it out. And then you have this really pretty color right here, which I use really frequently. It looks like a light purple, kind of like a taupe purple color. It's really pretty. But anyway, that was the first one I ever got, and I love it. Um, I've done a tutorial or two using this one. And then I have the True Love Quad. Yeah, that's what it's called, it's True Love. And you open this. This is like probably my absolute favorite next to my middle one um it comes with the creamy color right here and then this gold shade which i don't like this gold shade much because it is um it don't come out anymore it was one of those ones that was like gel almost like gel liner but anyway moving on i like the brown shade it's really pretty brown and sparkly and then you have another black shade a dark purple a lighter purple and then a purple that's just in between these colors and then you have this really pretty white silvery color and I love this I love the purples I love the way that in her um, in her palettes that she uses a lot of purple purples like a very beautiful color and these colors are very pigmented but anyway moving on to the very last one I have the Kat Von D palette that looks like this and it is called Love and Fury and then in this one it has a silver it's like a silvery white shade right here and then you have a silver beside of it and then you have another one of those gel colors that I don't like very much then you have a dark silver and then this black and this red right here are um, some more of those colors that or gel, line, um, gel colors, or you can use them as liners or eyeshadow bases, depending on how good they work when you get them. And then they have a really pretty purple with glitter and then a black with glitter. Um, out of all the palettes, they have a few blacks, and a lot of the blacks are matte blacks, but this one actually has glitter in it. It looks like it has bluish teal colors of glitter. But anyway, that's that one. And this is all that I want to do for this video. It's just a review. Um, out of all four of the palettes, I would give them probably a 9 out of a 10. Because I love the pigmentation of every single one of them, except for the gel ones. And like I said, I only have two of them that have the gel colors in it. But um, they're not really easy to use, the gel colors aren't. Like the, the shadows the, in their cell far, but the gel colors 
aren't very easy to use because where they're not sealed up they're um other than closing the pallet they dry out like really easy but anyway that's all i'm gonna do for this review i hope you comment rate and subscribe talk to you later bye now